Good afternoon. Hi, Aries. Good afternoon. Okay, guys, uh, we can start our lecture now. I started the recording. Uh, first of all, I was really, really happy to see you all yesterday. Uh, it was our first face-to-face -face lecture. Um, and hopefully in the coming lectures, it, the lecture itself would be much more enjoyable and we'll be doing many activities. Uh, we'll be revising uh, a lot of the things that we take in these online classes. Um, if you have any questions, any uh, suggestions, you can always ask me and you're always welcome to, uh, to say whatever you want. Uh, I just want to say that um, Arij yesterday make us, made a suggestion that we start our lecture by saying something about uh, the bill for declaration. So this is what we're going to be doing tomorrow, not today. I want you to prepare only one sentence, only one sentence, you know, a sentence, it takes only like 10 seconds to say, or maybe like five seconds. Just prepare one sentence in English, of course, uh, telling me what Belfort Declaration is or what you know about the Belfort Declaration, okay? Um, okay, so, and thank you very much, Arish, for suggesting this thing. Um, okay, so let me just share my screen with you. Today, we are going to have another um, listening lecture. Uh, first of all, as you always know, we start our lectures with a warmer and today it's going to be a tongue twister. I know you like tongue twisters. This is why I, uh, I add lots of tongue twisters. So let's see. The first one, how much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? Uh, guys, this is like wood khashab it means wood not like uh what we used to say in schools like wood or something no it's wood okay so let's see who would like to participate you can raise your hand or you can um write me in the comments that you want to say something you want to say okay go ahead nada okay how much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? How much wood would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood? <laughs> Thank you very much, Nada. This is actually really good. Thank you. Uh, let's see, Ramon. Yes. How much wood would a wood chuck chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? How much wood would a wood chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? How much wood would a wood chuck chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? Thank you very much, Rowan. That was excellent. Thank you. Uh, let's see, Sarah. Bismillah. How much wood would a wood chuck chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? Mm -hmm. How much wood uh, would would a wood chuck chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? Mm -hmm. How much would a uh, wood a uh, wood chuck chuck if a wood chuck could chuck wood? That's it. Right. Or another thank time. you. No, no. Thank you very much. This that was actually really, really good. Thank you. Let's see another one. Now, Shayma Sahli, you're going to be uh, telling us or saying the second one. Let's see it. Just a second. Okay. Give okay. Papa. Yeah. Give Papa a cup of proper coffee in a copper coffee cup. I myself. Uh, could not say it properly. Okay, can you try, Shayma? Okay, I'll try. Give Papa a cup, a cup of proper coffee in a in a copper coffee cup. Give Papa a cup of proper coffee in a in a copper coffee cup. Give Papa a cup of proper coffee in a copper coffee cup. Thank you very much. You did better than I did. Thank you. Let's see Malak. Malak? Yes. Uh, give Papa a cup of 
proper coffee in a copper coffee cup. Give Papa a cup of proper coffee in a copper coffee cup. Give Papa a cup of proper coffee in a copper coffee cup. Thank you very much. That was really good. Thank you. Let's see the one. Let's see. Give Baba of a proper coffee in a cover coffee cup. Give Baba a cup of a proper coffee in a cover co a coffee cup. Give Baba a cup of a coffee in a coffee cup. Thank you very much, Ryan. Thank you. That was really good. Let's see the third and last one. Peter Pepper picked a peck of pickled peppers. How many pickled peppers did be did Peter Pepper pick? Not B, okay? Okay, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Peter Pepper picked a bag of pickled peppers. How many pickled peppers did Peter Peter Pepper pick? Peter Pepper picked a bag of pickled peppers. How many pickled peppers did Peter Pepper Pepper pick. Oh. Yes, pickled. Pit okay, pickled. Yes, go ahead. Pickled. Okay. Peter Pepper picked a pack of pickled pickled peppers. How many chocolate peppers did Peter Pepper pick? That's enough. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Perfect. Let's see Razan. Razan Aisa. Yes. Yes. Uh, Peter Beber back the back of back. Beckled Bebers, how many Beckled Bebers did Peter be, be, Peter Bieber back? Peter Bieber back the back of Beckled Bebers, how many Beckled Bebers did Peter Bieber back? Peter Bieber back the back, a, be, a back of Beckled Bebers, how many Beckled Bebers did Peter be, Bieber back? Thank you very much. That was really, really good. Perfect. And let's see one last participant, Da'a da Muhammad. Da, we cannot hear you, Da. Yes, yes. Oh, yeah, okay, go ahead. Yes, yes. A bit of a blubber blocked a bit of a blocked bay bars. How many bickers bay bars did bitters bay bars back? Three times. Again? Yes. Please. Bitters bay. Blue bars black a bag of a blacked blue bars. How many black blue bars did bitters blue bars back? Uh, bitter blue bars blacked a bag of blacked blue bars. How many black blue bars did bitter blue back? Thank you very much. Thank you. So Peter Pepper picked a pack of pickled peppers. How many pickled peppers did Peter Peter Pepper pick? Thank you very much. Let's see. Okay. Uh, thank you very much. That's all what we have for the warmer. I hope now you are energized and feeling well. Let's see uh, this activity that we had for yesterday, uh, like the last class we had. So did you prepare this? Did you prepare it? Yeah. yeah. Yes, miss. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yes, let's yeah, see. Yeah. Now, I will be asking you, for example, I will start with the paper. I will say, where is the paper? Or do you know where the paper is? And you're going to answer, okay? So, let's see. First of all, where is the paper? Paper is number A, or the letter A. Uh, we said this is called a cabinet, okay? Let's see, uh, Shahid, Shahid Ali. Uh, the first one, what is the paper? Where is the paper? Uh, where, where the paper is? Uh, the paper is the no, second wait, drawer wait, wait, of the cabinet. Sahed, where is the paper? Or do you know where the paper is? Okay. Yes. The Ajan, paper, just the focus paper. on the form of the question. Okay. okay. Uh, the paper is in a second drawer of the cabinet. Thank you very much. In the second, in the second drawer of the cabinet. Thank you very much. Let's see, um, Rowan, we have Rowan, من غير أي حاجة. Rowan? Rowan? 
Rowan, can you hear me? It's okay. Um, let's see, Hiba, Hiba Hamdana. Okay, where is the phone book? Yes. Uh, where is the phone book? Uh, it is on the third shelf. It's on the third shelf. Thank you very third much. Shelf. Yes. Let's see. See, here's uh, the third one. Let's see, Arij. Go ahead, Arij. Okay, the answer is it's on the right hand, upper, upper, in the, uh, it's on the right hand, it's upper, in the drawer. Yes, so it's in the uh, right drawer and the uh, first right drawer of the desk, right? Yep. Yes, thank you very much, Arish. Let's see. Um, Shahid al Issi. We have yeah. D. Here is D. So, where are the pencils? Can you tell me where the pencils are? Yes, those are in, on the desk. They are on the desk. Thank you very much. Thank you. Let's see E. We have here the um, the CDs. Let's see Dima. Dima, where uh, are the CDs? Uh, in the first shelf. On well, in the uh, the first on. shelf. On the first on. shelf. Yes. Thank you very much. Uh, it's okay, Rowan. It's okay. Uh, okay, so uh, let's see if we have. Okay, I will show them all. Okay, so here we have F. Uh, let's see, Mariam. Mariam, where is the phone? The phone is in the first drawer of the cabinet. Yes, in the first drawer of the cabinet. Thank you. Let's see, G. Jinin uh, Auni. Where are the computer discs? Yes. On the middle shelf. Can you repeat the answer, please? They are on the middle shelf. They are on the middle shelf. On the shelf. middle shelf. Yes, thank you very much. Uh, did you notice what Jinin said? She didn't say it as. No, she said they are because we have desks. Okay, thank you very much. Excellent. Let's see, um, Nada. Can you answer H? Calculator. Okay. Um, where is H? Okay. The calculator is in the second uh, in the second left drawer of the computer desk. Thank you very much. Excellent, Nada. Thank you. Huda, also, you are excellent. You're answering in the um, chat. So let's see uh, who did not answer today. Let's see Azhar. We have Azhar, right? Oh, not Azhar. No, okay, you're not raising your hand, sorry. Uh, Malak? Yeah, Azhar, do you want to answer? Yes, sorry, yes. I'm sorry, here. Okay, it's okay. Uh, okay, so Azhar, where are the headphones? The headphones? Oh, it the, yeah, it is in the second uh, drawer uh, on the right of the desk Compu table. Computer yes, the computer table. desk. Thank you very much. So the headphones are on uh, in the second left, uh, sorry, the second right drawer of the computer desk. Thank you. And the headphones, we say they are, okay, because they are like kind of, we treat them as plural. Uh, and the, the last one, uh, Malak, go ahead. Okay. Uh, where are the notebooks or do you know where notebooks are? Um, the notebooks uh, are in the first left drawer and the computer desk. Thank you very much, dear. Excellent. Thank you. Or we can say the upper uh, drawer. Thank you very much. Okay, guys. So here you need to under you need to recognize the uh, proper prepositions that you have to use. Okay, when uh, describing places. Now let's see this. 
part of the lesson. I think this is on page 22 of your book or 23, I think 22. So uh, guys, here, I want you to look at the picture. We have two persons or two people. Uh, and I want you to describe the picture. What can you see in this picture? Are there any cats? Are there any dogs? Is there a telephone? Is there, I don't know, a computer? So you can raise your hand to describe the picture. It's okay, you can just throw some words. Um, okay, let's see Shahed. Shahed Ali, you want to answer? Can you please tell me what uh, exactly the question is? Describe the picture. What can you see in the picture? In general, you don't have to stick to the lesson. I know, just she wants to, uh, to get information about something. Maybe. Or yes. she, she wants she want to ask him about something she didn't know where, where is the place or something like that. Maybe because she's doing like this with her hand. So maybe, yes, she's trying to ask about the place of something. Uh, okay, let's see. Arij? Well, I don't know. I have a different... Uh, opinion i see they are in the office and that lady she's she looks like she's not wearing like a sort of i don't know it's not a normal clothes i see it's uh, it's maybe uh, what do we call it uh, what, uh, a uniform maybe. maybe i don't know because of, yeah so maybe they are in an office and maybe it's like uh, he wanted to ask her a question because i see like the phone and the and like on the shelves there are like there are some papers and that kind of stuff so maybe he wants to ask her um, about something related to those things i don't know maybe we are just making guesses guys there is no right or wrong here we're just making guesses maybe thank you Arish. let's see razan what do you think razan um, I think it's definitely an office. They look like colleagues or co-workers. Uh, there's a shelf full of books, or maybe it's an archive or something. There She's are like binders, for... yes. Yeah. The binders that you put inside the uh, files, yes. Yeah, looks like uh, they're having a short conversation. She's asking him stuff. I, yeah, that's what I think. Maybe, yes. Maybe. So what's the relationship between them? You said they might be colleagues. Yes. yes. Maybe. Co-workers. Yes. Or co-workers. Uh, or he's, yes. or like, I don't think uh, he's the boss or something. Yes, because it doesn't seem to be like a yes. formal uh, like conversation or a formal gesture. Usually when you're speaking to your boss, you're standing still and you just... Uh, you feel, exactly. yeah, some kind of like, you have a, a formal tone in your conversation. Uh, yeah. Okay, let's see Sujud. What do you think, Sujud? No. Okay, I think they are colleagues in, in the office. And uh, as my friend uh, said, uh, she asks uh, her, uh, his about something. And he tell him, uh, tell her what, uh, where is it? Yeah. Maybe, yes. Thank you very much. Maybe. Lena? Lena Nihat? I see uh, two persons. Maybe they are at work or they are a friend. Maybe that. Maybe, yes. So there are two people and they might be at work. Okay, so last, uh, the last participant we have, Rowan. Two person are chatting about something. I think this is a boy ordered something for this is the girl. And yes. uh, she wanted to know about uh, uh, about that uh, what you want. Maybe, yes. So uh, we have two people or two persons talking about a specific thing. Maybe they are co-workers. We will see now in the conversation. Okay, so... Um, Okay, so guys, from this picture, what are the binders? What are the binders? Are the binders under the table? On the shelf. Yes, the binders, thank you very much, are on the shelf. Um, okay, what about 
uh, the wallet. Can you see a wallet in the picture? The okay. On the shelf. On the shelf. It also. is also mm. on the shelf. What about the calendar? Where is the calendar? It's in the wall. It hanged on the wall. Hang on. On the wall. The wall. Yes. So the oh, yeah. the calendar is on the wall. Uh, what about the mug? Can you see this mug or the cup? On the, on the, the, on the table. On the table. On the table. Oh, yes, it's on the table. On the table. Um, okay, thank you very much. Now let's see the conversation itself. Uh, guys, now, as we did last time, I want you to listen and answer two questions. What is Fu? Oh, I, I cannot really pronounce his name. It's uh, an Asian name. What is uh, he looking for? And can he find it easily? I want you to listen. And as usual, I do not expect you to understand everything. Again, مش لازم تكونوا فاهمين كل كلمة مهم تسمع وتحاولوا تشوفوا الإجابات لهدول السؤالين. عايش هو بدور. And can he find it easily? Okay, you're going to listen. Okay, focus. Conversation two. What does it look like? Marlene, I can't find the what do you call it. What can't you find? You know, the thing for... Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. What does it look like? Maybe I can help you find it. It's a long, narrow, flat thing made of plastic. Okay. What color is it? And what's it used for? It's green, and you use it for drawing straight lines. Fuan, you mean a ruler. It's in the box next to the telephone. Oh, yeah, ruler. That's what it's called. Thanks, Marlene. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Okay. So, um... Okay, give me a percentage of how much you understood from this conversation. Yani, I do need a hundred percent. Okay. Yeah. Others, it's okay, guys. If سنة أولى يعني المفروض إنكوا تسمعوا هذه تحكوا عشرة في المية فهمنا والله بيكون خير وبرك. أنا مبسوط بكون مبسوط على عشرة في المية. Ninety percent. Okay. Who else? Sometimes, because uh, in this conversation or in this course in general, uh, you get to listen to many different accents and people from different places. So you do not always listen to Native American people or Native British people. So this is why sometimes it's a bit hard to understand every single word they, they say because the pronunciation uh, differs from a, play, from a person to another. Okay, so let's see. What is Fuan looking for? This is an N, but I, uh, I will tell you. So, what is Fuan looking for? Let me see your answers. Um, let's see Maryam. Maryam? For a, ru a ruler. Can you give me a full sentence, Maryam, please? She looking for a ruler. He is looking mm -hmm. for a ruler. Yes, thank you very much. So do you agree with her? Yep. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. I just put the emoji on the ruler. Yeah. Come on. Yalla. Uh, so what is Fuan looking for? He's looking for a ruler. Did you notice that all our answers were, were like, she's asking him for something, but the actual listening passage says that he is asking her for something. You understand yeah. my point? Yeah. So this is why I always tell you the guessing in the big in the beginning of the uh, lesson. It's not that like there's no true or false. It's uh, there's no sorry correct or wrong answers. They are just guesses. So he is looking for a ruler. Can he find it easily? Can he find it easily? Yes, Marua, thank you. Uh -huh. And let's see. Um, let's see. Uh, no, Jawabti. Okay, Rana. Rana Shanti. Rana is a mother job. It's small. Yes. Yeah, he finds it very easily. Can you hear me? 
Yes, Rana. Can he find it easily? Can he find the ruler? The ruler? He described it very clearly to her friend. So maybe he find it. Okay, thank you, Rana, for your answer. Let's see another person. Let's see another answer. And we will discuss and see which one is more accurate. Thank you, Rana. Let's see. Um, Rowan. Rowan, would you like to answer? Yeah. Okay, Rowan, what do you think? Can he find it easily? No, because he asking uh, care to where is he? And he's he is, asking. That's so hard. To, yes. Yeah, it's so hard, and it's and it's so hard to, to find the uh, the word for these things. Okay, and thank he you. Say, I don't know. Yes. Thank. Okay, and thank you. Let's listen. And this is Yes, thank you very much, Rowan. Let's see, Dima. What do you think, Dima? Do you agree with Rowan uh, or Rana? Um, with Rowan, I think uh, it's difficult to find it because he was forgetting. Uh, he forget the name of the ruler. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, he described it a lot for her. Yes. Maybe it take a long time to to guess what what this. It's a ruler. Thank you very much. Okay, so let's see one last answer. Uh, let's see Shahed Ali. At first, he find it little hard to find it, but then uh, when he described the th uh, thing, he looking forward to uh, Marlin. Uh, she helped him to find it. Thank you very much. So at the beginning, it was hard for him to find the ruler because he cannot. Uh, he cannot like remember the word itself. He cannot remember the term used for this specific object. Zayim, I know, for example, I'll like, "Bidil chisma, bidil hada." You know, this these words that we usually use. So uh, this is what he used while yeah. speaking. But then, as Rana said, uh, he could describe the um, the object easily. So he said, like, "It's uh, narrow. It's." green blah blah so thank you very much guys let's see now some other questions for the same passage you are going to listen again to answer these two questions what does the ruler look like guys now i'm asking you some details grab your pen or your pencil and you can write notes so that you don't forget um you don't forget the, the things that you want to say. And the second question is, what is it used for? I want you to notice the form of the question command. What is it used for? What does it, what does it look like? Okay? So what is it used for? You're going to listen to answer these two questions. Conversation two. What does it look like? Marlene, I can't find the what do you call it. What can't you find? You know, the thing for... Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. What does it look like? Maybe I can help you find it. It's a long, narrow, flat thing made of plastic. Okay. What color is it? And what's it used for? It's green, and you use it for drawing straight lines. Fuan, you mean a ruler. It's in the box next to the telephone. Oh, yeah, ruler. That's what it's called. Thanks, Marlene. I don't know what's wrong with me today. Okay, so what does it look like? Let's see, Hadil. Hadil, what does it look like? It's uh, look like it's a long uh, and narrow, flat things made of plastic, and uh, its color is uh, green. Uh -huh. And it's used for drawing straight lines. Thank you very much. So what? So what does it look like? You described the ruler perfectly. Let's hear this description from another person. Najas. What do you think, Najas? What does it look like? 
It's a long, narrow, flat thing made of plastic, and uh, it's color green, and it's, it's used for drawing straight lines. Thank you very much. So uh, when we describe this thing, this uh, gruller, he said that it's long, so it's length. It's long, it's green, the color. It's narrow, so not wide, it's narrow, and flat. So when we say a flat thing, it's like, this is flat, so flat, uh, and it's made of plastic. So what is it made of? It's made of plastic. Okay, let's see the second question. What is it used for? What is it used for? Let's see, made. Um, used to draw straight lines. It's used to draw straight, li straight lines. Yes, I mean, thank you. Uh, Zinat, do you agree with her? Yeah. Thank you very much. So it's used for drawing straight lines. Okay, guys, now I want you to notice this thing. We have something in the pronunciation focus called, uh, okay, you're going to see what I mean in a second. Now, when we have two words, before that, before that, you know the vowels in English? Do you remember the vowels? Yes. O, A, U, I, and E. So these yeah. are the vowels. So now, when we have two words in English, one ends with a uh, consonant sound, consonant is vowel, is a D, is a uh, P is a الأصوات هاي الأصوات اللي مش vowels will in the, with the second word starts with a vowel we link them together كيف يعني كيف أنا بحكي مثلا it's in بحكيش it's in the drawer مثلا it's in it's in it becomes one word linked together for example we say tip of tip of it's on the tip of my tongue. Tip of, okay? Vowel, uh, consonant and vowel. Color is. Color is. Now we are going to listen to the conversation itself here. Color is. So it's, it becomes one word. Made of. Made of. Guys, here we are talking about sounds, not letters. So when I say a consonant sound, hi. Made. Made, so the D sound is the consonant sound. This is why we say consonant and a vowel. So made of, made of, okay? Listen, and then I will uh, let you repeat these words. Pronunciation focus. Words ending in a consonant sound are often linked to words beginning with a vowel sound. It's in. Made of. Tip of. Color is. Okay. Listen to the converse. So, uh, I want someone to repeat these words to me. Uh, let's have... Okay, Lina, would you like to participate? Lina Nihad? Yeah, it's in. Made of. Tip of. Color is. Thank you very much, Lina. Thank you. Let's see Sarah. Sarah with an H. It's in. Made of. Tab of. Colors. Thank you very much. Color is. Uh, let's see who did not participate today. Let's see Zinat. It's on. Made of. Tab of. Colors. Galeries, thank you very much. Okay, uh, now I want you to um, wait a second. Pronunciation. No. Okay, now you are going to listen to the same conversation. You have it in front of you. You're going to listen and like spot some other examples for that pronunciation uh, focus. يعني حتى small. وتعطوني أمثلة تانية على نفس موضوع الـ pronunciation focus اللي توا حكينا فيه. A word ending in a consonant sound 
followed by another word starting with a vowel. Okay, وكيف حيكون لفظهم. Okay, you're going to listen and then I will give you a minute to try it or to try to spot some examples. Conversation two. What does it look like? Marlene, I can't find the what do you call it. What can't you find? You know, the thing for, oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. What does it look like? Maybe I can help you find it. It's a long, narrow, flat thing made of plastic. Okay. What color is it? And what's it used for? It's green, and you use it for drawing straight lines. Fuan, you mean a ruler. It's in the box next to the telephone. Oh, yeah. Ru okay, so That's we were saying that... Okay, we were saying that when a word ending in a consonant sound comes before another word starting with a vowel, we link the two words together. So we don't say it's in, for example, it's in the drawer. No, we say it's in the drawer. So you see, we make it as one word. It's in the drawer, made of plastic, tip of my tongue. Okay, so tip of, made of, you see, we make the whole, uh, the two words, we link them together to become one word. لما واحدة منهم تنتهي بصوت ساكن, زي اللي هانا, د هانا, الار هانا, and the p هانا, we, اللي وراها بتبدأ بفاول. So, I want you now to try... Conversation two. Okay. I want you now to try and find some other examples على هذا الموضوع من هاي المحادثة اللي عمالكم سمعتوها اوكي؟ اوكي ثانك يو اوكي I will give you a minute to think or to try to find some examples Excellent, Fatma. Thank you, Marwa. Yes, Reem. Nerjas, yes. Sundas, would you like to try and give us an example? Sundas? Okay, you can, guys, you can raise your hand. Nada, go ahead. Give me one example. Okay, um, there is does it. Wait. Or we can say previous of it. It is on the tip of tongue. It is tip. in the tip. It on, is in. On the tip. It's on. Yes, it's on. Yes, thank you very much. Or tip of. Thank you very much. Uh, of my tongue, tongue, you know tongue? I will come to this uh, in a second. So, um, let's see, Ren uh, Rena. Go ahead, Rena. Give us one example. Call it. Call it. Call it. Call it. Yes. Call it. Call it. Call it. Yes, it ends with a consonant and the other starts with a vowel. Thank you. Lena. Made of. Call it. Made Keep of. Off. Yes, thank you very much. Let's see Jinin Auni. Find it. Find it. Find it. Yes, thank you very much. Excellent. And uh, let's see Riem. Does it? Does, Does it? it? Yes, excellent. Thank you. 
And uh, one last example, let's see Hiba. Mm, uh, color is. Color is, yes, thank you very much. I'm, ha I'm, ha I'm really happy with your pronunciation, guys. So now, uh, yes. Now I want you to notice these things. Um, guys, for those who are new to our uh, classes, usually when we, discuss a wait i just need to okay usually when we discuss a listening passage or a conversation we analyze it uh to see what we need from this so for example here the purpose of our lesson today is to learn how to describe thing things الهدف من درسنا انه احنا نتعلم كيف كيف نوصف الاشياء not only to describe things but also to ask for their description. So for example, if I want to ask about the size of something, I say, what size is it? So he's looking, for example, for a ruler. I would say, what size is it? Is it a small one or a big one? For example, your mother is looking for her bag. You say, what size is it? Is it small? Is it big? So this is how we ask for the size. We answer, it's big or it's small, it's long, it's short, it's tall, uh, it's narrow or it's wide. So we have narrow and we have wide. Um, okay, what about the shapes? We will now get to know the shapes uh, in the second slide, in the, sorry, in the next slide. The shape, we have a round shape, we have a square, a square, we have an oval, Oval is like the shape of the egg. So uh, in Arabic, we say baydawi. So it's oval. So this is like the oval shape. Pointed, when we say something is pointed, it's like this, uh, the pen here, it's pointed. For example, the ruler, he, I think he described it as pointed. When we say something is pointed, it has an edge here. You see? Okay. Uh, something, when you say something is flat, this is like flat, your, your, uh, the surface of your desk, for example, is flat. And of course, thin. Uh, what is it made of? We are talking about the material. So what is it made of? When your mother asks for her bag, you say, what is it made for? And she, say, she says, for example, it's made of leather. Or it's made of um, plastic. 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 Your the bag is the bag is made of plastic. Okay, so it's made of cotton. plastic, cotton, yes, wood or uh, metal. And of course, the uh, the general question that we can ask is, what does it look like? Let me ask Alec, what does it look like? I'm giving you the free choice to say whichever description you want to say. فلما أحكي لك what does it look like? أنت بتقدر تعطيني وصف لإلها الأبيرنس تبعها الشكل بأي طريقة بدك إياها. So it's long, it's narrow, it's a flat thing. Okay, جماعة لاحظوا هنا لما أنا بحكي it's a long, narrow, flat thing. بس لو أنا بدي أحكي من غير كلمة thing أنا بس بدي أوصف الوصف نفسه بحكي it's long, narrow, and flat. يعني لما أنا بدي أحكي عن بنت بحكي She's a beautiful girl. She's a beautiful girl. Okay, في a في الكلام. She's a beautiful girl. لكن لما أجي أحكيها ك من غير كلمة girl بحكي She's beautiful. فهمي علي كيف؟ a دي بوهم بنحطها مع الكلمة نفسها مع النون نفسه مش ك للصفة نفسها. Okay. Let's see. Okay, let's see now these objects or these shapes. When I say, uh, what does it look like? When I ask you about a certain thing and say, what does it look like? You can say, it's oval. شكله بيضاوي. It's oval. Or you can say, it's round. Or it's square. Square هنا بمعنى, it's like an adjective. It's square, or it's pointed, pointed, pointed. Or you can say it's flat, 
or it's narrow, narrow as in this brush here, this brush here, you can say it's narrow, but this one here, it's wide, okay? So these are some shapes you can use while talking about or describing a certain object. What about these things here? When I say, what is it made of? I'm looking, for example, for my table or I'm looking for a certain table and I ask you, what is it made of? And you want to say this. Can you tell me what is it made of? Look at this. Wood. 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 Yes. Wood. Wood. So can you give me a full sentence? Can someone give me a full sentence? It's, it's made of wood. It, yes, it's made of wood. Thank you. What about these keys? What are they made of? What are Metal. they? Metal. Can you give me a full sentence? May soon. It's made, those keys are made of metal. Yes, so these are uh, made of metal. Thank you very much. What about these water bottles? The water bottles here. They plastic. are plastic. Can you, can you give me a? They are made of plastic. They are made of plastic. Made of plastic. plastic. Yes, they They're are made, made of, of plastic. What about this cup? This cup? Glass is in a glass. glass. It's made, it's made of glass. glass. Yes, it's made of glass. So guys, uh, don't say glasses. Glasses means like the eyeglasses that you uh, wear to um, see. Not but yeah, here we say it's made of glass. What about this lantern here? You know, when we used to make it in Ramadan? Paper. It's made of paper. 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 It's made it's paper. of paper, yes. What about this bag? This uh, suitcase leather. or a bag? It's made of leather. leather. Yes, leather. leather. It's made of leather. leather. Thank of you very much. Um, uh, okay. uh, okay. uh, okay. uh, this word here, is of so this sound is like the the sound but when i say turn off the light switch turn off بتصير بالاف يعني لما احكي او اف هذه لفظها اوف اي سوري لفظها اوف بالفي ساوند بس لما احكي او دبل اف او اف اف بتصير اوف فاهمين علي هذه لف... هذه باللفظ يعني انتم كطالبات انجليزي برضه لاحظوا الاشي yeah, هذا يا عشان هيك انا بحكي لكم it's made of leather it's made of plastic okay not off okay this is just for pronunciation now i want you to notice some some things here uh this is the thing that i told you it's a long narrow flat thing because here we have the word thing so it's a long narrow flat thing but when i remove the word thing i don't add the a so, uh, the a letter it's long narrow and flat without the determiner another uh notice here or another note that i want you to uh, notice when i say oh my god what's wrong with me it's like so what's wrong with me uh, another thing when i say like something is on the tip of my tongue يعني زي ما احكي ايش الكلمة هاي يا ربي عطرها في لساني عارفين الحركة هاي؟ نو no. عطرها في لساني yeah. uh, yes so it's on the tip of my tongue tongue is your tongue son. so it's on the tip of my tongue it means يعني I cannot remember it like I I almost remember it but I cannot remember the word okay so, like I know it, but I don't know what's the name of it. Exactly, yes. Okay, now I want you to do this exercise with me. We have nine pictures. I want you to use this, this part of the lesson. What size is it? It's big, it's small, it's round, equal, uh, sorry, square, flat, blah, blah, blah. Uh, and it's made of blah, blah to tell me or to try to describe one of these pictures. So for example, if I, uh, of course you are going to have some time to uh, write down your answers. For example, I want to describe, 
I will say uh, this. Okay, I will take an, an easy one. I will describe this one. I will say it's a round object. It's a round um, orange object. And in front of it, there is a triangle, triangular object. عارفين شغلة خليني أعطيكم بقية الصفات تاعونهم بعدين حرجع لكم لهذا الاكسرسايز تمام الريكتانجل والتريانجل والشغلات هاي حاعطيكم إياهم بعدين أرجع لكم لهذا الاكسرسايز خليها للمحاضرة الجاية لبكرة أوكي عشان يكون أبسط أوكي المهم جست يعني حاولوا إنه تحضروه وأنا المحاضرة الجاية رح أعط رح نشرحه بتفصيل أكثر أوكي uh, okay, so let's do this exercise. It's an easy one. I want you to have two minutes, I will say, and try to give me names of objects that are made of wood, plastic, metal, glass, paper, and leather. So, how long take a time to write about the objects made of wood, plastic, metal, glass, paper, and leather. You have two minutes. Go ahead. Think and write on the uh, on your notebook or on the notes you have. Just give me one object for each um, material. Is it easy or difficult? No, no it's very easy. easy. I'm just, just... It's easy. Good. Let's see. Jeanine, I will repeat the question. You, uh, you need to give me one object only that is made of wood, one object that is made of plastic, metal, glass, paper, and leather. Yani, uh, for wood, you can say a table. A table is made of wood. Uh, metal, you can say a spoon. A spoon or a fork is made of metal. So give me one example for each material. Got it, Janine? Inshallah. Okay, go ahead, Yala. Think you have one minute. Okay. Okay, did you raise your hands, guys? Let's see. Sarah, uh, Sarah, there's a new Sarah in town here. Sarah Hijji? Yes, that's me. Yes, go ahead. Wood? Okay. A uh, thing made of wood, it's uh, a door. A door, thank you very much. Let's see another person telling us wood. Something made of wood, Dima. Uh, maybe a computer desk, a desk or doors. Yes, maybe a computer desk. True, might. Um, stand. Stand. Yes, thank you very much. Yes, or you can yeah, say, um, a picture frame. A picture frame. Yes. Can I? Yes. Go ahead. Nada or who's who's uh, saying? I am Janine. Okay, go ahead, Janine. Uh, the pencil and uh, the door, the table, pencil. the chair. Thank you very much. Okay, let's see plastic. 
Sara uh, Hirtani, can you give me an, uh, an object made of plastic? Yes, uh, a bottle. A bottle, yes, bottle. A bottle of water, for example. Let's see, Nahla. Maybe a uh, cups. Plastic cups, yes, could be. Uh, let's see, uh, Haya. Haya, you want to answer? It's okay. Let's see, uh, Aya Musa. A fan. A fan made of plastic, maybe, yes, true. Let's see, metal. Something made of metal. Um, Reem. Reem Salim. Hey, hi, can you hear me? Yes, go ahead. Yes. Okay, maybe the door. A door or, made of... Or a, a cage. A, a cage? A cage. Okay. 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 Key. Okay. Yes. Okay. So your keys. Yes, the keys are made of metal. True, and the uh, some doors can be also made of metal. True. Thank you very much. Asnan is saying knife. Spoon. Yes, a spoon. Thank you. Uh, Jinin Auni. Spoons and knives and keys. Thank you very much. Yes, excellent. What about glass? Can you name some things made of glass? Uh, Could let's I? See, let's see, Nada. Cups or plates? Yes, cups and plates. Arish? Window. Windows are made of glass, yes. Uh, Narges? Doors. Doors or uh, I cannot hear you. Can you, can you repeat the word? Vase, a vase. The vase, yes, a vase or a vase, both are correct uh, pronunciations. Mirror. <laughs> Rezana Isa is saying Billie Eilish's heart, as she, sa as she said. You're, that's smart. I did not think of that. Thank you. Yeah, the, the lyrics says, uh, um, heart made of glass, my mind of stone. Yes. This is, this is so accurate. Uh, okay, let's see, uh, Lina. One last thing made of glass. Can see about the paper? Okay, go ahead. Book, notebook. <laughs> a book and a notebook, yes, correct. Yes, let's see Shahed Ali. Can I, doctor? Uh, about the glass, it's a uh, cup and dishes. Yes, cups and uh, paper dishes. Yes, okay. Uh, Shamsroor? Can I? A plastic? Uh, no, no, paper, uh, paper dart. Paper, uh, excuse me, can you repeat it? Paper dart. Drone, you mean, or uh, a kite, maybe? Yeah. Maybe, yes, correct. What about, uh, do you know guys the paper bags that we uh, sometimes buy groceries in? When you go to buy groceries, um, maybe it's not a common thing in our culture to use them. Yeah, it's other time, Yes, okay. for, uh, for groceries, usually uh, they give you like brown bags and they're made of paper too. So they call them paper bags. And what about leather? Leather. Uh, let's see, Me, Shayma. I... Shayma Sahli. Can I? Yes, the bags and the clothes are made from the leathers. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, who was just saying, can I? Raise hand. Who was, uh, who wanted to answer? Yes, Marwa, a wallet, yes. Dresses made of leather, a belt is made of leather, jackets are made of leather. Thank you very much, guys. These are great uh, answers. Can they have a bubble hara? 
which uh, which ones belts you had leather belts in Bab al Hare Maru Yamalak? We already no, brown. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Brown bags. Okay, Bab al Hare. Okay, I'm sorry. You're talking about the store because yesterday I had like I accidentally watched some parts of Bab al Hare and Musals of the series. So I was like, what? Bab al Hare and Musals can feel leathers? Okay, whatever. Uh, this is what staying in home Can does I? to us. Okay, sorry. Uh, let's see. Okay. Um, Can one I? Last participant. Yes, go ahead, Janine. A bag, handbag, and a face. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you. Bags and handbags, everything, or boots. Sometimes, yes, they are made of leather. Okay, guys. So, uh, before, as I told you before, when we have a topic for discussion, I give you like an hour and a half, but today I'm going to give you an hour, but I want you to prepare something for the next time. Uh, did you watch the video that I posted on uh, the group? Of course. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It? Did you like it? Yes. Did you understand so it? I was yeah. alarmed. Okay, guys, by the way, this channel, it's called Studio C, especially like some older videos uh, are so funny. Like, I love to watch these videos. It's like, uh, we call it family friendly comedy or clean comedy. So uh, they post videos like this, they're in English and all of them are funny sketches. So if you are interested to watch something funny in English, you can always watch videos from Studio C, but like older videos are much more, um, I don't know, like inter entertaining than their new ones. So uh, you can watch them. Now I want you for tomorrow's class to watch this video and tell me, no, no, don't play it. Okay, tell me uh, what is the thing he's describing? What's wrong with that thing? Could he say it easily? And how did he describe the thing? What does it look like? What does what is it used for? Is in the video, can be how it no use of issue my aunt and to take cool issue other issue. What are Tony issues? What can you hear? Yani he said like bears eat it. What? So he said like uh, when you are I don't know in a in a concert and you get it gets squished in a beautiful description is kind of weird video it makes sense okay so uh try to watch it and if you did not get it try to watch it again just to give me the whole idea it's okay uh, give me the idea of the video and try to answer these questions, okay? So we will be describing or we will be discussing this video tomorrow uh, in our lecture. المحاضرات الوجاهي رح تكون أنا حاطيكم فيها تمارين زيادة رح نناقش فيها ونعمل يعني حلقة discussion تكون وحركة أكتر ويعني الأشياء الفيس تو فيس دائما بتكون ممتعة أكتر حتى من الإلكتروني فإن شاء الله هذا الكلام رح يكون في محاضرات يوم التنان بالنسبة لمحاضرات الخميس خليني أنا حرجع أكد لكم موضوعها تمام it's not يعني 100% accurate المعاد خليني أنا حرجع أكد لكم تمام؟ اوكي، هل انت انتم حتشوفوا الفيديو، جاوبوني على الأسئلة هاي، و I will see you guys tomorrow إن شاء الله. Hopefully you understood everything in this lecture. If you have any questions, please uh, ask me. Do you have any questions? Yes. Yeah, I have. Yes. Yes. What about the term? The midterm أنا حاعطيكم ال حاعطيكم بالتفصيل. ظهر عندكم ال midterm ال الموعد على الجدول؟ يا yes. 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 خلوني أنا أتأكد yes. أنا أعطيكم إياه لحد ما يعني أعطيكم الخبر اليقين عشان ما بديش أعطيكم بعدين أقولكم يا جماعة تغيروا يا جماعة مش عارف إيش فعشان هيك 
Yes, who wants to ask? Ness, بالنسبة للكويز. الكويز، yes. العلامات حتظهر اليوم إن شاء الله، يعني بالليل. طب ليش تأخر هو؟ يعني صح بيكون لما نخلص الكويز بتظهر العلامات بعد ما يخلص الوقت؟ أنا عملته ما يظهرش عشان أنا ما بدي إياه يعني أنا كنت في لخمة الإلكتروني اللي هو إيش بسموه الوجاهي، يعني كنت تيجي قدامه على الجامعة. فانا احط لكم كويز واحط لكم بوستات لها علاقه بالتعليم الوجاهي انا قدمت لك يا ساري لحظه يا ساري فحيصير لخمه كثير على المجموعه وانا عارفه انه مش كل البنات بيفتحوا وبينزلوا في البوستات عشان هيك انا بدي اخلص لكم لخمه لخمه اوكي؟ اوكي ثانك يو هو وونس تو اسك يس اجين ساري يو كان اسك مي مي مين اللي نطط مي ثواني ركزتش جو هيد اسك اول امبارح ما كانش في جدول عندي اورال فيوم الخميس انا لسه بالجداد الشعاب اللي عندك مش ذاكر اظن مثلا ثلاثة تمام انت من الثلاثاء الخميس يس بس انا حاكد لكم آه. على محاضره الخميس تمام ان شاء الله تمام Do you have any other questions guys ساره كنت بتسالي شيء بس عادي لو ما اجيش من الوجهه هو صراحه لازم يعني انه يعني الوجاهة حيكون فيه تعليم اكثر يعني شيء ممتع اكثر وحاعطيكم اسئله وتمارين اكثر فيعني تراي از هارد از بوسيبل تو كم لانه انا برضه حاخذ عليه حضور وحاخذ مشاركه وهيك عليه حيكون علامات المشاركه عليه تمام يس هو وونس تو اسك ساري دكتور يس اريج بالنسبة لجدول الامتحانات النصفية دكتور وليد حكى لنا انه اللي اللي عندنا على الموديل يعني هي تغير فما بعرف هل هل كلام صحيح ولا لا انا عشان هيك انا سمعت نفس الكلام سارة الساعة الساعة واحدة ونص سارة ممكن تكتبي لي في الشات اللي بدك اياه سارة ممكن تكتبي لي في الشات اللي بدك اياه لانه انت صوتك كثير بيقطع ومش سامعة صراحة ايش بتحكي اريج سالتيني على اه عشان هيك انا بحكي لك اريج انه ما بدي اعطيكم انا موعد ويروح يتغير ف فانا لانه نفس الكلام سمعت انه حيتغير الجدول فخليني انا حاكد لكم بالنسبه للامتحان ساري اكتبي لي بس في الشات اللي بدك اياه بس أريج. يا دكتور المفروض اللي هي الكليه يعني تحكي لنا يعني انه جرب خالص يعني انا خايفه يحكوا لنا في سبعه الشهر في سته الشهر لانه الواحد لسه مش محضر يعني مش محضر نفسه لماده معينه عشان هيك بدي دراسه من هلا <تصفيق> لانه بتضمنوش يعني انا بصراحه انا بدي بدي اساعدكم بس انه بتضمنوش يعني انه هي ما انا عارفه ما نسيت من يزنق حاله عشان هيك فاهماكم يعني ف يو نيد تو ستدي صراحه ما عنديش انا يعني معلوماتي زي معلوماتكم في موضوع الامتحانات اي هاف نو ايديا دو يو هاف كويستشنز الجماعه اللي رفعين ايديهم في حدا عنده اسئله ولا بس رفعين بالغلط مش بدي اسالك هلا انا ما حضرت يوم الاثنين الوجاهي آه. وعندي محاضرتين يوم الخميس ينفع احضر يعني احضرها مع يوم الخميس بدل ما اجي مرتين على الجامعه صحيح اه ما فيش مشكله بس اعرفي معادها يعني انا من 8 ل لل... لا عارفه معادها عارفه عارفه معادها شفته من الجدول بس قلت عشان احضرهم كلهم يوم ما واحد ما مشكله بس احكي لي في يوم الخميس نفسه عشان انا اسجل اسمك يعني في الشعبه نفسها رح تصير تحضر خلص آه. تمام يعطيك العافيه الله يعافيك انا قدمت لك كويز على الوحده ونص بس لما رجعت على المود ما لي الا محاوله اهتم هي يا ساريا بس انت بتقدر يعني انت اذا قدمت المحاوله الصباحيه ورجعتي حاولتي تقدمي المحاوله المسائيه مش انا مش هحسب لك المحاوله المسائيه يعني خلص انا هاخد بس الاولى فما كيف يعني انت قدمتي ولا ما قدمتيش يا ساريا لا الوحده ونص هذه محاوله انا اعتبرتها يعني صباحيه عشان انه جدول الكهرباء فوحده اعطيتكم اياها الصبح والساعة واحدة ونص للتنتين والتانية عملتها في التوقيت التاني للكهرباء الساعة ستة تمام خلص هيك مية المية أنا هي اللي قصدي فيه صباح ومساء على جدول الكهرباء يعني تمام do you have questions guys؟ لينا ميد عندكم أسئلة؟ يس يس روان هلا نيجي يعني على الجامعة نفس الجدول اللي أعطونا إياه في المواعيد لا بدك تمشي ولا انت حسب ما كل دكتور بكتب لك كل دكتور بكتب لك محاضره واحده حيكون غالبا عندك في الاسبوع 
ماشي انا قدمت بالمحاولتين وطلع لي عشان هيك انا لما فتحت الاولى قدمتها ماشي لما فتحت على الساعه 6 بدي احضر محاضره عندك من اللي قبل من الاوائل لقيته بنفع اني افوت كمان مره حسيت حالي مش ح... يعني مش آه حابه آه. فينش للاول فحليت آه مرتين حاخذ بس الاولى انا تمام خلص اه تمام تمام اتس اوكي مريم يو كان جو اوكي جايز ليت مي جاست فينيش ذس ليكتشر ثانك يو فيري ماتش فور اتندينج تودايز ليكتشر اي واز ريلي هابي تو سي يو اول اور تو هير يور فويسز وان شاء الله ان ذا كامينج كلاسز اي ويل سي يو فيس تو فيس سو بليز بريبير يور سيلفز فور توموروز ليكتشر اند اي ويل سي يو ذن اوكي يلا جود باي اند سي يو ان شاء الله اه اند دونت فورجيت ايش اللي طلبته منكم انه اللي اقترحته اريج انه في اول المحاضره كل واحد انه تكونوا مجهزين لكلمه عن وعد بالفور يعني مش كلمه انه جمله صغيره خمس ثواني 10 ثواني شيء شيء بتعرفوا عن وعد بالفور تمام؟ سو ثانك يو اريج فور سجستنج ذات اند بليز جايز تراي تو دو سو ثانك يو فيري ماتش اند هوبفلي اي ويل سي يو ان ذا كامينج كلاسز جود باي ثانك يو باي جود باي سي يو اون مونداي ان شاء الله سي يو وبتمارا اوعوا تنسوا تمارا يلا yeah, like, goodbye